Okay, I'll give you an example. I have a rubbish phone here. A rubbish phone here. A rubbish phone here. What we lack in is that we don't even say thank you. Like a small appreciation would go a long way. Like if you remember last Eid when we had the nice roast and the nice javel and then we went and chilling into other people's houses. I'll be grateful. Do we show our appreciation? If not, then start today. Like it may be you think it's really, really cheesy, but it means a lot for our parents. They sacrifice they lie for us, they put buckets loads of stress in every single day, they're constantly under pressure like money, bills, other children, family, but yet they always have the time for us, we need to show that we have the time for them. May we never forget how much they have done for us when we were small and helpless, and they always supported us. Do we show the same love and support? Do you know when you were a small baby? And whenever you see these new cute little babies and you're like, oh my god, they're so cute, you would want to make them laugh, you want to look after them, you want to care for them. And then when they would hug you back or when they would cry, they would go to you and you have that connection with them. Once upon a time that was you and your mother was, with that, with, was like that with you, your father was like that with you. And now when you're older, that same baby is saying, isn't listening or is respecting and is showing love. 
and then that really shows a stronger connection with you and you're pleasing your parents and you're pleasing Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. The father is, oh, is the key to Jannah and the Jannah lies under your mother's feet. So to please one, you please the other and you please Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. He is the only man that cares for you when you are upset, will never make you cry, will always give you the best advice in me. What we fail to do nowadays is have that little communication with our parents and we always sing on Facebook, Twitter, YouTube. Yeah, we do benefit it, but do we act upon it? So today I want you to, like, when you're at home and you watch something and you really, really want to say it, say it. Because start with your intentions, like the brother said previously in other videos. You should always start with good intentions and then act upon it because then you'll be rewarded for that. And then at the same time, your other siblings, your other family around you will be, will appreciate that. You won't know it until later. Today let's make a special dua that may Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala bless our parents with Jannah, inshallah. Say Ameen. Ameen. If you didn't say it, I swear your cousin said it behind you. <laughs> By the way, I may look a bit more tan, but I was just chilling in front of the bakore for a little too long. Today make the intention to put a smile on their face, no matter how hard you think it is, just go for it.